ladies home. It's a very light material. There's a plastic film on one side and there is it on the other. It's an inexpensive material. A sheet costs less than two dollars and you can buy it at Noah's. We built our sky out of it. Dow Blue Fan forms that is filled experimental aircraft really nicely. Just a little hot glue, some tape for fix scheme, some battery, and some extra stuff, and a hot glue gun, and you can build a plane. If, if we did not have food all fan form, we couldn't experiment as much as we do. It turns out that it's really quite durable. Oh no! Oh! When you build an experimental airplane, you need to go through flight travels. And that might um, lead to the road of crash land. And when we started on Sky Eye, we had the motor right here, and that was in our test flights, and then that didn't work so well, and we crashed like a billion times. <laughs> And we really built this plane tail heavy so we could put um, a camera up front. So we can put like equipment and a little pilot up front. So when we did an initial fight, we ended up having a lot of crashes. And the Dow Blue Fan Fold really held up pretty well. Oh! Bodies, and that gave it really a lot of strength. And you can form it for the wings, and we have these just beautiful wings on here, and they're Epler 421s. And they're really nice. We've crashed it on the side and bonked it, and my brother's bonked into it, and it's still pretty well not beaten up. our RC Oxbox wing design and it's both light, efficient, and durable. Building with Dow Blue Fanfold gives us lots of options with design and we left it out in the rain and now look it, it turned purple. We, knew, we know lots of people that build with Depron and we're hoping to use it that someday. But for now we're using Dow Blue Fanfold and we're really happy with it. So don't be afraid to go out and get some and build some airplane. And all of our designs so far have been built with it. a lot of flexibility and it's given us a lot of fun. This is a pretty minor crash and 